Okay. Ah, Dupin. And you've brought someone from the real world. I know why you're here. The Cardinal's grave is in this cemetery. And you want to go into his past to change the present. To do that, you'll need the Hourglass of Death, which is inside this crypt. Is that like Lilith from Supernatural? Unfortunately, it's been sealed. Okay, I like the voice actress. She makes... it's creepy, but young, but... sinister all at the same time. A man in a mask cast a spell on the crypt, cutting me off from time. The Cardinal's fate line is broken, but we can fix it. Bring me the Hourglass of Death. And I will help you go into the Cardinal's past. Like, what is this thing here? <laughs> is that hair? Like, what is that? Crazy. That was... The hourglass that Death was talking about is in this crypt. That was pretty creepy. I agree. Sounds like Snow White. Yeah, so far the voice actors are pretty good in this series. I mean, I think in general the hidden object games don't get enough credit for their writing, for their story, I guess that's the same thing, but I guess basically their character building and, and what have you. I don't know if they get enough credit for it. <laughs> Mm-hmm. This must be the hourglass that death wants. Let's take a peek again. That is in there pretty well. Let's see here. Oh, it looks like we got some coffins we gotta put on there. Like, do you not hear that kind of like, yeah, yeah, like there's some weird it's a cat in heat or what that is and then there's like croaking frog or something <laughs> what is going on whoa whoa statue what are you doing give me your thing there please if a statue holds an item in a game it's usually important you hear it okay good because I thought I was going crazy Rip Cardinal, 1627 to 1677. Oh, I need the money though. Give me that cat money. Three cat monies, please. The first of the three deceased. Let's start with him. Let the puzzles begin. That wasn't much of a puzzle, but I'll take it. We now have three out of three rhombuses. Oh, here we go. Now we're going to get into some tricky puzzles. I agree. Hopa games do deserve more credit. And it's part of the reason why I started playing them is I kind of felt like no one was. Right? When I started doing these videos many, many moons ago, I did it because no one else was. And, um... You know, now it's obviously got a little bit more uh, folks doing it. Because if you remember, I started my channel with like Plants for Zombies and like Half Life and like Crisis and like basically some first person story driven shooters. And I was like, eh, let's, just try, let's try this uh, Strange Cases thing. And I think Puppet Show was actually one of my first hopas too, back in the day. And the rest is history. Three of three snakes. Let's go into the crypt. Cat money will make the cats quiet. I like it. So. A 
thought I saw that morphing. This episode is brought to you by X, L, and B. Hello, people. This is called World Align Beginning. So I've got myself an oiler. Looks like we need to get a, put a, looks like a sun there. Look at this baby. Baby dragon? Sure, let's just hop into the strange crypt. Why not? Looks like we gotta put this here. Press the plates in the correct sequence to open the grave. Select the images in ascending order. Hmm. Interesting. Baby, grown up, grandpa. Uh, let's see here. Seed, flower, apple? Okay, yay. What's my favorite game? Holy moly. But it wasn't XIB, Shaco, it was XLB, right? So let's go see what's cooking over here. I don't even know what my favorite. I mean, I go back to Dire Grove as the one hidden object game that hit me so hard that I went, wow, these games are cool. So that's always got a sweet spot in my heart is uh, Mystery Case Falls, Dire Grove. The Keeper of Secrets. There are many keepers located throughout the world. They keep dangerous artifacts out of the wrong hands. Mm -hmm. Alright, Bumblestick, thank you for stopping by. So let's see. Blue creature. Man, there are some serious uh, vibrations going on here. Hello, Sarah, how are you doing? Stay safe for you too. Ew, cobwebs. Oh. Oh, if we light it up? Light it up. up. Oh, it burned all green and yellow and red. And we got some glitter over there. Bracelet, please. There's where another gargoyle goes. And another one. And that's it. Let's put our bracelet on and then we'll do the clicking. Very clever. Wow, that is a interesting looking sun. <laughs> a little on the creepy side. Let's go ahead and put the sun over here. And we get our last little gargoyle dragony thing. It's a pinkle creature, yay. Looks like we're gonna have to come back here. Nope, oh, that's not what I wanted. And we got our puzzle. We got a puzzle. Put all the creatures into their positions. When you select a creature, it moves to the nearest free space. If the space is occupied by another creature, it will move to the nearest free space. Wow. 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 So move this guy. Oh, I think I just screwed it up already. Hang on. This one here, maybe. Oh, wow. Oh, this is wild. How in the world do I get... Which one is this one? Is it this one? Or this one? Okay, the... Oh, it's here. Interesting. How come I can't click it twice? <laughs> Coin in the eye. Oh, I missed it. Uh-oh, Rose. We'll have to go see if we can spot it. So which one is this one? I can't even tell anymore. The, the shapes are all... Oh, it's a spider. You like Nancy Drew games? I do as well, Connie. I do as well. So, which one is this one? I can't tell. I don't... This one goes here, so I need this one first. But I need this one. So this one is here, this one is here, but which one is this one? I did not pay close enough attention. It 
Is it this one? It's this one, isn't it? Oh my gosh. So then I need this... This one. Okay, okay. But I think I screwed up, though. <laughs> Crap. I think I did one too many, because now... This shouldn't be here. Okay. Let's try this again. This one for sure is first. And then this one. And then this one. And then... This one. So how am I going to do this now? So if that one goes in and then that one... I think I need to do the right side first. Okay. I think we're good now. Now we need to do this one, which is this one, this one, which is that one. I think we solved it, folks. And then we do that one, and then that one. Cool! Yay! How do I feel about Hope of Crossovers? I love it! I think it's fantastic. I think it's something that gives you, as a fan, a little bit of a, you know, the best of all worlds, I guess you could say. I think uh, when Elephant Games did it with Detectives United, I was floored by the concept. Fantastic. So did we get it? Oh, no, not yet. Did we get the morphing object here? I forget if we did or if we didn't. All right, let's do the glitter. The glitter. Ooh, it looks like we're placing. Hello, hello. Let's see. That is a weird looking face there. We're basically breaking his ribs. Because that's how we roll. It's got some lovely music. Oh yeah, Tennessee is warm? What is considered warm in Tennessee? I couldn't even imagine. Crown, obstacle, death part, bird, is that a puppy dog? Where is this wingo? Oh, it goes way up there, wow. Hello, hello. Darktail's Black Cat was your first game? Cool. Okay, where does this crown go? Ah. His rib cage is gone. The ruby is mine. Come here, ruby. Ruby Tuesdays. So I think that ruby's gonna go in. Oh. Put that up there. Your first was Final Cut 5. Wow. Nice. The Hourglass of Death. Now remind me, folks, did we get the morphing object in here? Oh yeah, it was the snake over there, wasn't it? So did we get all our coins? We did not. Haha. -ha. I want to make sure she doesn't have a coin in her eye, too. Hello, Day Rover. He's... she's back. Give me the hourglass of death. Give me never guess. Don't you know your manners yet? Kind of feel like I shouldn't give it to her. Like, chat? Help me out here. Am I crazy? Yeah, I feel like the same thing, Liz. This is not a good idea. <laughs> Hello, CC. How are you doing? Uh, okay. That's better. Now I can open a portal into the Cardinal's past for you. You will have exactly three turns of the hourglass to save his life. 
If you don't return before the time expires, or the hourglass breaks, you will remain in the past. Do not forget this. Thank you? Congratulations, you got a new achievement! Yay! What did we get? I mean, now I'm curious. Pop goes the achievement. Deal with death. Survive a negotiation with death itself. Redemption Cemetery. Ooh, ooh, I'm gonna write that one down. We've been keeping track of all the uh, Amex games. And so far we've got Dark Tales, Haunted Legends, Puppet Show. And I just wrote down Redemption Cemetery. Thank you for that one. Oh, you Black Omen, you take care of you. You don't worry about me. Yeah, don't trust the girl. You don't like her tone? Right? Oh my goodness, what's going on here? Wow, the place looks like a war zone. What happened? This must be the cardinal here. 